I want to mention just one other thing related to the Trump trials. The latest move from Trump's lawyers is to try to stop his civil fraud trial over covid. And this is just so damn funny because Trump's never been concerned about covid. And also his lawyers, while arguing in court, were all super concerned about covid in the court. None of them are wearing masks, which if they were actually concerned, they might be doing. Here's an article from Business Insider, which says Trump's fraud trial began week four on Tuesday after skipping Monday due to a covid outbreak. An unmasked Trump watched as his unmasked lawyers asked that the trial be halted due to risk of infection. The judge declined, saying, hey, N95 masks were available in the courtroom to anybody who wanted one suggesting clearly you're not that concerned about covid because you're all here and none of you are wearing masks. Now, honestly, this is just absurd on its face. It's completely absurd on its face. It is truly a last ditch effort and it didn't work. And this is not going well for Donald Trump. Trump actually coming out of the courtroom or maybe coming into the courtroom. Who knows at this point and saying what they did about covid is terrible. And then he just goes on to attack the judge. And now he goes into some of his other greatest hits about why it's all so unfair. Consider that Trump couldn't even be bothered to stop campaigning when covid was at his highest point, holding mass rallies and the entire thing. And now a trial has to stop because someone in the court has covid. Uh, I do think that these are the kinds of people who will try anything they can think of to delay the trials, because if it works, then that's great. They're successful. If it works and then Trump ends up becoming president, Trump will try to use being president as a reason why the trials can't continue now. And so they're out of ideas. They're willing to try anything anybody thinks of. And this is the latest thing. Covid. We have to stop the trial. Good for Judge Ngoron, who I guess I've, I've been pronouncing his last name and Goron incorrectly. I, apparently it's in Goron. Good for Judge Ngoron for not going for this. I'm sure they'll come up with something else. We'll find out what it is, I'm sure, later today. If you're like me and I know so many of you are just like me, you hate the sticking and the rubbing that comes with traditional underwear. I'm sure most gentlemen in my audience know what I'm talking about. Our sponsor, Sheath Underwear, solves the problem. They have a patented ergonomic underwear design, separate compartments in the front. Everything stays dry, cool and comfortable with sheath. You do away with the chafing and the sweating. Everything can air out and breathe and be fresh large variety of designs, something for everyone. The air circulation in sheath underwear allows for a huge difference. And you've got to try it yourself to understand. I can tell you firsthand next level comfort down there. Sheath also now is offering super comfortable women's underwear as well as silky smooth base layer undershirts and bottoms for men. Sheath has world class customer service, super fast shipping over 20,000 five star reviews. Sheath is the perfect gift for the men and the women on your shopping list. Check it out at sheathunderwear.com slash Pacman and you'll get 20 percent off with the code Pacman. The link is down below.